Hey guys, Huawei India today showed us two of the brand new Honor devices, the Honor 4C and the Honor B, B as in honeybee. So we're going to check out the Honor 4C in this video. The price is not revealed, it's probably going to reveal when this device is formally launched on the 8th. And, but uh, you know, spec wise, this guy has a 5 inch screen, HD resolution, it has a brilliant 2550 mAh battery, Emotion UI 3.0, runs on KitKat but then Huawei promises uh, lollipop update very very soon we're gonna check out this phone a little closer here the hardware and the user interface here yeah? as I told you before it has a 5 inch screen HD resolution that means 720p of resolution on top you have a 5 MP front camera your earpiece and the LED lights and the sensors and stuff below you have the typical Huawei shortcut keys the back home and the recent app key on the left side there is pretty much nothing here you have the micro USB 2.0 port and the mouthpiece and then you have the power button, the volume rocker here, on top you have the 3.5mm jack. Behind you have the 13MP autofocus camera accompanied by an LED flash and I like that metallic accent around the uh, camera and the LED flash there. You have a secondary noise cancelling mic, the Honor logo and the speaker grill out here. The whole phone is made of plastic, there is not a hint of metal, uh, even on here where this kind of looks like metal texture, but actually I think this part is not metal. But overall the phone looks quite thin, although it's not the uh, lightest device in the market. You can open the back flap, and once you open it, the back flap is quite tough by the way, uh, it will reveal the 2550mAh battery underneath, and it's a dual SIM phone plus a micro SD card, it's not a 4G phone mind you um, the battery is non-removable so that's how the back look quite colorful i also like this contour here kind of this depression here that kind of helps you grip the phone better but i wonder why that's not on this side they would have made it a perfect symmetry out there so uh, we're going to check the user interface it runs on emotion ui version 3.0 that's on top of android kitkat uh, Huawei promises Android Lollipop shortly, but when it comes to the market, it won't come with Lollipop out of the box. So that's something you need to um, keep note. Uh, you've seen Emotion UI, I'm not going to go too deep into it. And probably um, I should straight away go to the 13MP back camera. And there you see um, the exit door behind us. And it's not exactly lag free it takes some time to acquire the focus yeah mostly because it's uh, not low light here uh, let me just switch off the flash and see so once you switch off the flash it becomes much faster the buffer is good enough yeah and then you have beauty shot and then your videos you can start recording video from there you can take still simply by tapping there and then you can pause it start it again the device lags a bit in all transaction you, you can see but definitely this is not a retail device so we can't talk about the complete uh, the final user interface the final OS right now uh, let's go ahead and check out the settings here first about phone and you can see actually it runs on 4.4.2 and then let's see how much storage you'd actually get so out of 8 GB you'd get about 3.65 GB when you buy this device it looks quite smooth and seamless but we haven't multitasked with it enough so we're going to stress test the user interface the performance of the Kirin 620 processor and 2 GB RAM when this device comes to our lab for full review. But for now guys, that's a quick look at the brand new Honor 4C that's going to be formally launched on the 8th. The price is not here, but then uh, you can see it on the screen somewhere. The 4C, it's definitely going to be cheaper than the 4X. The 4X has become very, very popular and I just have a feeling that this guy is going to be equally popular as well.